A car is left wedged between a house and a bank after it careens off the road. These images show the damage that could have been caused when the truck hit the side of the house at around 4.40am today. I'm Rose Alabone. I'm here at Upper Kaikarai where a man is lucky to be alive after he crashed his Nissan Tirano into the wall of this rental home at 420 Stewart Street. Police say there has been minimal damage to the interior of the house. The truck's impact broke off part of the guttering and caused some cracks in the facade of the brick house. It hit Mel Steringer's kitchen while he was asleep at the other side of the house. A coffee cup got shut out of the kitchen cupboard onto the floor so that broke into pieces. Stringer says he was awakened by what he thought was an earthquake and the sound of a man's voice. Yeah, he basically said, I'm really sorry, I just drove my car into your house. And so I looked outside and turned my head and yeah, there it was. Stringer says the man who was able to exit the vehicle and walked away unscathed did not appear to be intoxicated. I don't know how he and got he's out. he's not badly hurt? No, nope, not at all. He did not have any injuries or anything, luckily. A police spokesperson told Allied Press the SUV, which was proving difficult to move, would be taken away by the end of the day. Roselle LeBone, The South Today.